natural disasters My baby has been around for me Kingdoms have fallen, angels be calling None of that could ever make me Hi guys, so good afternoon and welcome back to my magical world I am Frostbite and uh, yes, hello guys. Currently it's 2.31 in the afternoon and we're going to proceed reading again. So this will be short but sweet. Short and sweet guys! Okay, so our, ti our, ti our title for this one is Begin Somewhere. Pastor Johnson answer his phone. Hello, is this Pastor Johnson? It is. This is the IRS. Can you help us? I can. Do you know a Bill Wilcox? I do. Is he a member of your congregation? He is. Did he donate $10,000? He will. What you can do, you can do. What works? Work on that. Don't wish you could do things you can't do. Instead, think of what you can do. Everyone who gets where he is had to begin with where he was. Only one person in a thousand knows how to really live in the present. The problem is that we seldom think of what we have. Instead, we think of what we lack. So this is very common, guys, especially if you, are, if you were raised in a household where, um, you know, there's always not enough. There's like a scarcity mindset if you were raised by that kind of, um, you know, environment. So you really have to think differently okay so i'm here to tell you that because it is important and it is necessary to to shift your perspective okay so we don't need more strength or more ability or greater opportunity what we need to use is what we have so says basil walsh people are always ignoring something they can do and trying to do something they can Learning new things won't help the person who isn't using what he already knows. Success means doing the best we can and what we have. So Norman Vincent Peale said, We've all heard that we have to learn from our mistakes, but I think it is more important to learn from our successes. If you learn only from your mistakes, you are inclined to learn only errors. In fact, some people spend their whole lives failing and never even notice. So the main thing that's wrong with doing nothing is that you never knew when you are finished. When you are through improving, you are through. Use whatever you have been given and more will come to you. Never leave well enough alone. You can't control the weather, but you can control the moral atmosphere that surrounds you. Why worry about the things you can't control? Get busy controlling the things that depend upon you. So, Orison Marden says, A strong successful man is not the victim of his environment. I'm gonna repeat this. This is relevant. And you need to hear this, guys. So, a strong successful man is not the victim of his environment. He creates favorable conditions. The person who gets ahead is the one who does more than is necessary and keeps on doing the doing it. Oh, actually, it's done, guys. Bitten. So it's it's like that, guys. So don't be. Um, you have to like focus on what's ahead of you, instead of thinking of your current situation. Especially if your current situation is not, you know, favorable in your um, in your on you on yourself okay so make sure to think differently so, you know there are a lot of ways to have a comfortable happy um you know fulfilling life so it is really up to us how to navigate this life this game so um yeah so i think that's it guys i'm really grateful ah, my sister is so noisy so guys, I just want to say thank you to all of you who keeps on watching and patronizing my uh, channel. Uh, you are amazing guys and I hope uh, you are here with me to grow with me because, you know, I'm always here. <laughs> and thank you guys for listening and thank you for helping me make this world a better place for all of us and for the future generation. I do love... Um, guys, please do like and, you know, you can like and do some comments if you really want to.
Okay guys, so it's color a day. So uh, we're, we're going to continue reading. So I hope that we can really finish this book right away. So thank you guys and see you again.